I'm Molly Martinez at Sharon Wood Park in Columbus, where Congressman Tim Ryan just made a pit stop with Moms Demand Action on a caravan that will end at Senator Mitch McConnell's office in Kentucky. Mitch McConnell needs to get off his ass and get this done. Okay? Yeah. Congressman Tim Ryan didn't mince words Thursday morning at a gun law reform event outside Columbus. He's calling for lawmakers to Hello. pass universal background checks. You guys are all starting to look the same in your red shirts here. Refusing to take up the bill. The number one responsibility in my mind for an elected leader, whether you're a councilman or you're a congressman or you're president of the United States is, how do you keep your citizens safe? The stop is one of many on a caravan headed for Kentucky. Moms Demand Action member Laura Robertson Boyd says the goal is to tighten up gun laws while sending a message to those unwilling to act. If our current lawmakers won't make change, we will elect gun sense candidates who will. So I do feel like we do have momentum in this fight. That momentum is evident. In the wake of the Dayton shooting, Governor Mike DeWine called for background check laws, and Republican Congressman Mike Turner shocked party members by calling for an all-out ban on assault rifles like the one used in Sunday's attack. Kudos to Congressman Turner. Uh, kudos to Mike DeWine for putting putting a, a real solid initiative out. I wish it went a little further, but I, it's, it's great. I mean, it really is. For Laura, she hopes this caravan will help clear the final roadblock for universal background checks. Americans have had enough. We know that 95% of Americans support universal background checks on all gun sales. The bill is sitting on Mitch McConnell's desk. That bill has already passed the House, but has yet to see movement in the Senate. In Columbus, Molly Martinez, Spectrum News.